Good day to everyone. This is your Phoenix. Back to do another energy update for the sign of Capricorn. Just keep in mind these are general readings. They're not going to resonate for all of you. But for the ones that it does resonate for, please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. For those of you interested in a personal reading with me, all the information is in the description box below. For those of you that would like to join me on my spiritual channel, the link is also in the description box below. Alright, so let's see what is happening here for you guys. Okay, so you're about to receive communication of some sort that is going to cause you a bit of concern. It could be from a person that you're wanting to have a connection to, or this is you. Ready to have some type of communication with someone. It concerns a new relationship. So for a lot of you, this is someone that you want to be in a relationship with. But you feel like this person is playing games. You feel like they're lying to you or deceiving you concerning something or concerning wanting to be in a relationship with you. But things are about to change on that front. For some of you, it could be an actual move. So this person may actually be reaching out to you to communicate to you. But you're tired. You're really tired here. You're frustrated with the whole situation. You're tired of being the one to put any work into this relationship. So you're waiting for this person to come towards you. You're keeping your composure about you. Yeah. Things are definitely changing in your favor. So the universe is going to bless you with some type of opportunity. Or there is going to be a lot of love coming into your life very soon. From a specific person. It will be a new relationship. So it's not someone from your past. It's someone new. Yeah. You're going to be very concerned with why this person is communicating with you. You're going to be suspicious by nature. It could be a family friend or you could know this person through a family member. But you have been going through a series of changes and transformations recently. And that is definitely is going to help you to cope with this new relationship. This relationship might definitely turn into a marriage or a long-term commitment for some of you. But there is definitely a commitment coming your way. Or someone coming your way wanting a relationship with you. You probably knew this person for some time but were unaware of their intentions or their feelings for you. This could be a family friend or you could meet this person through a family member. But there is definitely this loneliness that you feel that is about to come to an end. So for a lot of you, a relationship is coming towards you very soon. One that you may not be expecting yet. Yeah. It's like you've given up on relationships. You've given up on any hope of having a relationship with anyone. But this person is definitely coming in to you to take action when it comes to love. To offer you a relationship could be a Scorpio, Pisces, or Cancer for some of you. But you're at a crossroad. You're trying to figure out where do I go next in my life. That is one of the questions you're having right now. What do I do? Where is my life supposed to be going? Yeah, you're feeling like you're down on your luck recently. You feel like things are just not going for you the way you want it to. You feel like things aren't quite working out for you.
but it's time for you to step into your Empress energy. Now, this energy is of growth. This energy is somebody that has gone through a lot and is standing to tell the story. This is a very fruitful energy. So you need to start accepting your power and know who you are as a person. Some of you could be a Sagittarius, you'd be dealing with or Libra. You've been walking away from a lot of people recently. You've been walking away from anything that doesn't serve you emotionally. You've been walking away from a lot of people, places, and things. So you've just been leaving everything that you feel is not serving you behind. And you're moving forward. Because you're trying to find you. You're trying to find your happy space. You're trying to figure out what lights up my world, what makes me happy. Hmm. But you do have a wish that is going to come true very soon. It is going to be in the form of an opportunity, a promotion for some of you. But this is stability. This is growth in your life that is about to come in a very big way. You could be dealing with an Aries Leo or Sag. You're feeling uninspired right now. You're feeling like you need too much control because you feel like you have no control. But there is going to be a celebration coming. You're going to be victorious in whatever endeavors that you're trying to pursue. For a lot of you, you'd meet this person at a party, a wedding, some type of reception. Yeah, you've been doubting yourself a lot recently because you've been feeling like you're not good enough for a relationship or you can't find a relationship that is worthy of you. But like I said, that is coming in for you and you're beginning when it comes to love. So for a lot of you, a relationship is what it is you've been trying to, to have. But everybody you seem to meet seems to be leaving you more disappointed than the person before. The universe is trying to get you to heal, to let go of the past, to let go of things that didn't serve you. And for a lot of you, you have been going through this healing process, whether you know it or not. That is the reason why this offer of love is finally coming into you. You needed to heal from some broken past experience. For some of you, it could be a younger water sign. Yeah. But that cycle has closed off and a new one has begun for you. So there is definitely a turn of events here for my Capricorns. That is definitely taking you on a new journey. So for some of you, it could involve travel. You could meet this person while you're on vacation. Yeah. This person is going to be very passionate. They're going to be very outgoing. This person is more of a get go type of energy. Somebody that knows exactly what it is they want and they know how to get it. Yeah. You're going to be receiving a lot of clarity when you do meet this person. Um, it's going to be like an epiphany that is happening for you. Mm -hmm. Because you've been emotionally unavailable for so long that you forgot what it felt like to be in love. And I think this person is going to stir that in you. They're going to stir your insecurities for sure. But it's time for you to get out of your own head and get out of your own way. Because though you have been healing, there is still some emotional unavailability here when it comes to you. Because you felt like there was no one out there for you. You gave up on relationship. You gave up on ever having a relationship again. But I do see someone coming towards you very quickly and speaking their truth. So someone is definitely on their way to you. It could be a soulmate connection. But this is definitely spiritually guided and some type of past life connection. 
you may be afraid to take a leap of faith with this person because like i said you may have known this person for a while just not in the capacity of a relationship you may have known this person through a family member of yours that is their friend or something of the sort but there is going to be an offer made to you very soon that will turn into a long-term committed relationship that will turn into yeah you've been having patience and you've been waiting for this person to show up so it's like you gave up or you were telling people that you gave up but deep down what it is you wanted was your forever person yep this person is coming into you emotionally ready to have a full long-term committed relationship with you this person will be your happily ever after this person will be your emotional fulfillment because you've been doing the work on yourself you've been doing the healing on yourself and you've been asking the divine to send you the correct person that is right for you that person is going to show up very very soon it could be for some of you in the month of october libra season or it could be in november for scorpio season but this person is coming in very quickly this is not going to take very long to show up for you mm -hmm. this is coming in very very soon so for those of you that have been out of a relationship for a while this person is about to show up for you Imagine all unwanted thoughts dissolve into light, creating room for new opportunities and possibilities for your life. So there was an ending that needed to take place for transformation to happen to clear space in your life for this new love to show up. Surrender. At times, we must surrender the old before something new can enter our lives. Let go and all will work out. So like I was saying, it's time for you to let go of the past what is coming is something that you've been desiring something that you've been wishing for something that you've been working on yourself to achieve which is a full long-term relationship for a lot of you deep in your heart you already know the answer to what feels right so for a lot of you because this is a family friend of some sort or you're going to meet this person through a family member, you're going to question if this person is right for you. You would already know the answer to that question. Time, you are trying too hard, give it time. So some of you, you want it now. We all do. But this will show up for you in Libra season or Scorpio season. So that you can definitely be sure of. And when this person does show up, make sure and don't push them away. Alright, so this is what I have for you guys. I hope it does help. Have a good one.